Um, she's, she's gone to the bathroom, she's told me to be really quiet because her mum and dad are asleep in the next room, that's fine, her, her sisters are asleep, her brothers are asleep, I've got to be really fucking quiet. So I'm, I'm really excited about the fact that I'm going to have sex with this girl who's just gone to the bathroom. And, and I'm looking around her room excitedly, as you do when you're that drunk guy at a girl's house. And I glance down and I see a little pair of knickers on the floor. And I'm not proud of what I did, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> <laughs> but I thought, I'm going to have a sniff of those. <laughs> <laughs> so, I bet that I pick, up these, I pick up these knickers and they are tiny, right? They're like, I, I look at them, they're lilac, cute. Give them a sniff. <laughs> And they're, they're just old enough to smell great because of the fact that they're old, but they're new enough that, you know, they're not, you know, you shouldn't shatter them or anything like that. <laughs> <laughs> like two days in, that's all fresh. <laughs> and I sniff these because I have a little look at the label while she's in the bathroom. Oh, size 8 to 10. Oh, I can't wait to get my eyes on this girl. Just, just as I'm thinking this, the door flies open and she catches me with her knickers in my hand, pressed against my nose, and the guiltiest look you can imagine on, on my face. So, ladies and gentlemen, long story short, I'm thrown out of her house. <laughs> I'm on the bus on the way home. I'm fucking kicking myself, knowing that I'm going to have to go home and have a wank. <laughs> and then I think, I've got a trophy in my pocket. Put my hand in my pocket, and I pull out the lilac knickers, ladies and gentlemen. Yes! I open them up for one more little victory sniff. <laughs> and then I have a proper look at the label. And they're actually size 8 to 10 years. <laughs> <laughs> I've still got them. I'm going to you've been fantastic. You've got a great Fucking smashed it. <laughs>